welcome everybody and we found a somebody I don't know quite who there she is beautiful regal leopard I'm trying to get identification of doesn't stand out to me immediately so I'm going to need some help everybody with your ID we are in the middle of Juma here and she's looking into the drainage three spots on the left spot pattern there's a female Double H reckons a very muscular leopard, I don't think so. Very sort of a, a beautiful female. I mean, now that she's looking like that, it's looking, oh, it's not Lalamba, I'm sure it's not Lalamba. It's definitely not Lalamba, everybody. I don't know who it is. There we go, it's a nice look at her face, please, if you do know who it is, let me know. That was a nice image. Let's see the other side. Oh, there we go. Come this way. Yes, that's a good girl. Sort of. Sort of three and a three. Looks like a youngish cat to me. They're gonna walk straight towards us here. Beautiful leopard, beautiful, beautiful cat. If she keeps up this, this is Shadulu's territory. So I wonder if she knows that uh, she is it at interact with Shadulu a lot. So what's happened with Shadulu? So the vehicles just try to get around in front, try to get a front shot. You can see that it doesn't influence them at all. They keep moving. There's no real um, behavioral change in our cats. The habituation process of many of these leopards is quite powerful, quite strong. There's a squirrel. Oh, hello, beautiful. Yes, that squirrel's alarm calling at you. Now, if she makes a kill, let me just move up again quickly, Darren, and then we'll stop and watch her walk until the end of the road. We'll go to this bump, and then we can view her the whole way down. How blessed. A new leopard for my list. In my first few weeks here, we got Shadulu just moved into the property. She'd come from um, Ingrid Dam down in the south in Singita, Ottawa area. And she was very new to the area. She just walked in here and just sort of took over. And I fell in love with her immediately. And now on my last day, we've got a female leopard who's been around the block. 2009, she's twice as old as Shadulu, at least. Now she just finds herself in the middle of uh, Shadulu's territory. And right here, about 50 meters in front of where Moya is now, is where I had the interaction between Shadow and her cub and Tundi. Those of you who might remember that sighting, it was quite something. It was the last thing I expected. We were coming back from Chitra on our way back to the camp, and there these leopards were interacting. Shadow walking, or parallel walking, Shadow is trying to keep Tani from getting anywhere near her cub, and Tani's intention was, we don't really know what, but don't think it was a good one. 